beautiful people of the interwebs tuning in here from our forest base camp behind me is the platform that volunteers and my amazing special person and myself helped build and on top of that is going to go a 16 by 24 foot canvas wall tent we got our tent from white duck tents uh and I'm gonna unpack it. Well, I've already unpacked it, but I'm gonna organize the pieces to see if I have everything I need and maybe I'll put it together. So let's see what we got. So there she sits, all wrapped up. I came here two days ago and the night before last, we got a very, very heavy rain, over an inch, maybe even an inch and a half of rain. Um, so I wrapped her up in a tarp and kept her safe from wind. So I'm gonna unpack her and get organized. So here is what's happening. Um, when I unpacked the two boxes, or three boxes, one of them is the outer canvas cover and the other two appear to be identical. Uh, so we're gonna unpack them and see all their parts I put them separate so I don't get confused. And uh, fingers crossed that we have everything we need to get this up and functional like today, okay? Fingers crossed. Here's what's up. They, the two bags are identical. The contents are identical. It appears that there are two floor cloths, which seems unnecessary. Uh, so I'm gonna open up the box that has the outermost canvas shell and hope and pray to the tent gods that everything I need is in there. Okay, <laughs> um, I don't see the things that I was looking for in the third outermost shell bag, um, but I did find some treasures. Got this, QR codes. You just got your hands on the highest quality gear out there. This is a good time to let it all sink in, take a moment to revel in the satisfaction of making one of the best decisions about your outdoor gear yet. So that makes me feel pretty good, but I'm still wondering where the rest of my stuff is. So uh, let's see what else it has okay. to say. <laughs> it was just more hooray. Um, here's the owner's manual. Let's see if it has a list of the things that I'm supposed to have to ease my troubled mind. Congrats, you're about to make some incredible memories. Hooray for the children who are going to be here and my amazing stuff. Blah, blah, blah. Let's see, looking, looking, looking to see if what comes. Here we go, with your tent. 16 by 24, 12 foot pole, 12 foot roof pole, don't see that. Ridge pole, don't see that. Connection pole, four way angle kit, gold and silver. I don't see any of those things, so I'm feeling concerned. Toolkit, don't have any of that. JPEG, VPEG, pin and rubber mallet. I don't have any of that. So we are in a heap, my friends. These are all the things I'm supposed to have. I don't have any of them. So I've already emailed White Duck. I have filled up the form submission. I've spoke to a chat member and I think I just have to wait, which is very hard. So we're gonna pause here for now uh, and I will let you know how we carry on. All right, so here is the update. Uh, just called the folks at White Duck, super friendly, very down to earth. Um, so, so far their customer service is getting like a 10 out of 10 or five stars. Uh, they did indeed send me two duplicate boxes. So 
I don't know if FedEx is gonna come pick up the extra box or if I have to find a way to lug this like super heavy thing to FedEx, I don't know. Um, but they did make a mistake and they're going to rectify it. So we are putting the tent build on hold. I will reassemble the unpacked bags and then cover them up with the tarp because main, snow, rain, wind. And um, <laughs> we will hit pause on this adventure and keep our fingers crossed that they can expedite the third bundle and we could get this thing built soon. Thanks y'all for being here.